Today is July 28th. Yay. In 24 days, it's gonna be the Great American Eclipse, which is basically we're gonna have a total solar eclipse traveling all the way across the contiguous United States. For most people in the US, it's gonna be a partial solar eclipse, but if you are in the path of totality, which goes from Oregon to, I think, South Carolina, you will see a total solar eclipse. I'm around Kansas, so my solar eclipse is at magnitude 0.91, I believe. So it's not too bad, but if you're in some places in California, I think it's like 0.77. So depending on where you are, you might get a better solar eclipse. To prepare for the event, I bought from Rainbow Symphony some solar eclipse material, and we're gonna unbox it on camera. First off, check these out. We got some eclipse shades. Look, it even has the solar eclipse date. See, August 21st, 2017. What? Now, if you buy your goggles on Amazon, you gotta make sure that it has some requirements, and I can't remember what those were, but it has to have like the certain ISO number, and it has a certain company name. I'll put a link in the description that talks all about it. So this is what is printed on the inside, right? And these are just two free goggles that I got with my actual plastic goggles. I could just hand these out. Here are the Eclipse shades that I bought. Whoa, now I have my glasses on. Whoa, I really can't see anything. I can be totally blind with these, Aveline. These are wraparound goggles. They were 20 bucks. Pretty cool, huh? Nothing's printed on the inside. It does say Rainbow Symphony. I thought maybe they would be good for my daughter. You think you could look at the sun with these? <laughs> oh, you look so cool. I also got a solar filter to go over my camera lens. Let me go get my camera. My lens is 72 millimeters. This is 76 millimeters, so it should fit. Oh, it barely fits. I knew it was, a, I knew it was gonna like barely fit. Oh, that sucks. I mean, it kind of fits. Mm, I don't know, Aveline. It is either the 76 millimeters or 90, and I thought 90 would be just too crazy big. Damn, this was like $20 too. Anyways, day of, of the solar eclipse, I'm gonna try to take some good footage. I think it'll be really great because the last total solar eclipse was in 1979, and you had to be in a particular place, I believe it was Arizona, and the last total solar eclipse to travel across the United States was 99 years ago. So this is a rare event and we have to see it. Right, Emily? Yeah, and we don't have to really travel anywhere. I'm gonna leave some links down below for some articles that I read that I thought were helpful. See you guys later, bye. <laughs> okay, so I got the solar filter to work. I just cut a couple slits in the side to get it to fit over. And we're taking some test footage of the sun. I'm trying not to be shaky because I don't have a tripod. But it's amazing having live view. Instead of doing all the guesswork, I could just check the live view and I could see it. Oh, it's so perfect. That's so great. I can't wait for August 21st. Yay! That's zoomed out. That's zoomed in. Wow, it's the sun. Okay. <laughs>